Hey guys, Ricardo here. Welcome to another Blog Tech Tips. Today I'm going to show you to fix this issue here, as I'm about to show you. And it involves the um, option or the error right here that says damage SD card. Notice it says right here, guys, um, SD card is damaged. Try reformatting it. All right. So I'm going to explain what's happening, what you can do to fix the issue, if anything can be done um, to give you a better grasp of the situation. All right. So, of course, the system is basically early warning you that the SD card is damaged. And of course, um, this could be for several reasons. It could be just that the SD card is corrupted and as a result, it's reading and saying damage. So in some cases, it can be definitely damaged. In others, it might just be a quick error. All right. So of course, as suggested, formatting might help. So the first thing I advise you to do in these cases, guys, is to go ahead and what you want to do from here is to try to back up anything that you have on your SD card. How can I do this? Basically, you can try manually removing the card from your device. And then this Alcatel doesn't really matter. It's an Android device. Any Android device, even Samsung, this will apply. To remove the SD card, you can try attaching it to a computer and backing up your files. It also goes without saying that you should have backed up your files even before this started. All right, let's say that you have gotten your files backed up and now you want to save the SD card. What you're going to do is to go ahead and try the formatting that they suggest. So go ahead and... Um, So go ahead guys and you're going to go to um, settings so seeing that it's already um, backed up i'm going to do try the format i'm going to do it on this i'm going to show you where to find the settings so go to settings um, this device is a little bit slow so go ahead and scroll through we're going to go to the option that says um, storage usb it might say storage on yours go ahead and select and of course you should see here use your layout of the storage um, device a device storage and of course it shows you here that the sd card is corrupted now corrupted here means that for some reason maybe um the card was maybe the card is just bad or maybe it's just an error um you can go ahead and select the card and as i said again this thing is a little bit slow um notice identify its portable storage which is the sd card itself and you're gonna go ahead and select so once you do, it should say your this card is corrupted. To use this card, you have to set it up first, which indicates that it's um, corrupted. Now, um, you have two options here. As I said, by if you hadn't removed it before, now would be a good time to cancel this, go back, take out the card, and try to read it on a computer. It might read, it might not read, but chances are you should be able to back up your files, and if they are safe, you should be good. Um, you could also try going in manually and browsing through your file system, such as your pictures, and see if your pictures are intact. But it's always a good idea to back them up, all right? Um, once you go ahead and hit setup, it would format the card. I do not want to do this right now. So setup is basically meaning that you're acknowledging to format the card. So if you hit setup, follow the on-screen instruction, it will try to format it and try to overwrite the card. It should fix it. It should come up as a fresh card. You should see the storage and you should be able to start storing files again. So I'm going to cancel. Um, you could also do the same thing from your computer as well. Once you back up, you could format it from your computer, then place it back into the phone and it will read afresh. Or you can just do a quick format on the phone again to finalize. All right. So um, as I said, it's just a um, formatting issue. Um, if the error keeps on consistently happening or you keep losing your files or files keep disappearing, I suggest that you um, change that SD card. It's faulty, and what could happen is that it's not a good card, and over time it will keep messing with you like that, or it could just crash 100% damaging and losing your files. So it's a good idea to get a new card if possible, if the problem consistently happens, all right? So that's just how to deal with this issue. If you do all of that, you should be good. All right, so Ricardo Gardner basically showing you to fix this issue or how to deal with that you're getting a damage SD card warning. All right, Ricardo got the same mind until next time. Bye.